Right, good morning. Um, sorry about the terrible lighting. It is raining outside a lot, so there is not very much light in here. Um, get an idea of what it's like out there. Um, unfortunately, if I turn the lights on inside, um, which will give you guys a bit better view, in some ways, um, you also get the glare off the lights because they tend to be right behind me a lot of the time. So we're just going to see how it goes without them on, with on the stand. Um, I am going to be doing a upper body workout. I'm going to have to be very careful because my wrists are still giving me a certain amount of shit, to be honest. Um, possibly because of all the knitting and yeah so let's give this a go see what happens and keep my fingers crossed that my wrists don't give out on me again so today's outfit is a um, green style pace skirt which still fits me despite everything um and a harry potter t-shirt plus a jersey that i knitted myself a wee while back and a merino alpaca bottom lead So you'll hear Chloe in the background. reckons it's because I don't have my hands in the right position but when you're doing things like this your hands in relation to your shoulders are shifting position all the time I'm just going to pause for a moment and go and see if I can find another mat. Speak with you to Mike. Okay, so I've got a different mat. Um, this one is the memory latex with a microfiber top. I guess we'll find out if it's any better. Worst case scenario, I can flip this one over. Oh, damn it. I just realised the other light is giving you guys the lead too. Hopefully that's better. <laughs> okay. Reverse plank. Just a three. Let's 
still not ideal. It's still slipping, but it's slipping on the carpet now instead of my hands. So I think we're going to have to give Chloe a miss today. So I'm going to flip this thing back over. I do have one other mat that I can try. Um, which is basically an all rubber one. And it's not a yoga mat. It is a workout mat, but not a yoga one. So instead of Chloe today, we're going to use the barbell instead. So I'm still going to get an upper body workout. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Okay, so I love the concept of these things, but they do not stay in up. And I think it's because they're plastic, they you know, the screw up bits. So just giving myself a little rest before I start the next section. Now the glare out that side, I can't do anything about that is basically the sun behind the clouds so I can't switch that one off okay Use free weights next. So these are three kgs. I'm going to do standard bicep curls. Pardon me. Three, four, I'm actually feeling this already, and I think it's because of the fact that I was doing that stuff with the um, barbell before. And we're just going to do a few of these as well, which works slightly different muscle groups. just realized I forgot to put the garden fork in the garage when I finished with it the other day. I think it's because I didn't actually consider myself finished with it. I still had more stuff to dig over. But because it was quite hot that day, I had to stop and I didn't get back to it. Okay, so we'll do that.
So it's sitting out there in the rain. Eleven, twelve. Okay, one more lot of. I'm gonna go through with these ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They're running out of bolts. <laughs> I think we're just going to be doing 10 at this one. 10 and then we'll do these ones again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Right. So I think that's going to do for today. I will be doing probably some time on the sit-up bench as well but that's in the other room and it's currently covered in stuff so I've got to remove the stuff I only take a moment it's only my husband's old um judigi and I'll just put it on the sewing machine behind it which is where it actually needs to be to get fixed so there's that and um I might do some rowing this afternoon, just depends on how things go. Um, it's also going to depend on how cold it is out there because it is quite chilly today. I mean, we are in autumn, but um, it's gone from being like 27 degrees to, and this is Celsius, to I think today's meant to be about 18. Let's just have a quick check. So for my town, weather forecast for today is a high of 14. Right, so it's actually going to be colder than I thought. And it is currently 9.5 degrees outside and feels like 6 degrees because of the rain and the wind. I'm just going to check how warm it is actually in the house. Look, uh, lights, 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 lights. It is currently, I'm oh, sorry, 9.6 in the ceiling and 19.1 in the house. So, not cold, but not warm either. Um, my ideal temperature is around about 24, 25. 
anything above 25 and I start to feel a little bit overheated. Um, anything below about 22 and I start feeling a little bit too cool. So my ideal temperature range is fairly limited. <laughs> and I live in a place which gets, at least the last few summers, super hot from time to time in the summer and pretty cold in the winter. Um, I mean, nothing compared to say like Canada and places like that where it gets to uh, minus however many degrees centigrade. But far enough away from my comfort zone to feel freaking freezing to me. <laughs> so anyhow, that is it for me for today. Um, I'm just going to quickly show you what I am working on for my knitting. So it probably doesn't look like much from here. You can see it a bit more now. So it's twisted stitches and twisted cables. And that is the second round of Sock Madness. So that is what I will probably spend most of my day on today. Um, so yep, yeah, that will do for me. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully Chloe's not going to be doing stuff that's going to set off my wrists. So I can actually do the proper workout instead of making up my own as I went along. <laughs> but at least I did something. So... Basically, that's the way it's going to work. If Chloe's doing stuff that I can't do, then I will either adapt what she's doing if I can, or I will change to using my free weights instead. Seeing as I don't have many machines at the moment. Um, did look at getting a machine at one point, but we didn't really have anywhere to put it. So, I will see you guys later. Please like and subscribe. And I'll be back tomorrow.